Hello everyone. Hello. Today we're going to be talking about yoga. Yoga. And yoga has so many benefits for children. Um, one of which is it helps them with their anxiety because they learn how to breathe. Um, breathing is important. Very. Another one is that it improves their emotional regulation because they're like checking in with themselves. Good skill, good right? skill. Right? Very important skill. It also boosts self-esteem because yeah. when you nail that pose, you feel really good about it. You mm. feel positive, ready to go. Mm. It also increases body awareness and mindfulness because you're being very like in touch with your own body. And it enhances concentration and memory because they memorize the poses, they do them over and over again. It also develops their strength and their flexibility because they're learning new ways to move their body like Christian will be demonstrating today. I'm already more flexible. Um, already. <laughs> already. It's amazing, like the turnaround time, it's amazing. Right. Um, so Christian is gonna be demonstrating these different poses today um, because he's the athletic one. I'm gonna be telling him the poses to do. So the first pose that we're gonna be mastering is a pose that I like to call dancer's pose. Whoa. So what you wanna do is you wanna pull one of your legs and you wanna extend your arm. Ta-da! I'm like the Wii Fit Yoga Lady. You do look like the Wii Fit Yoga Lady. You did it. Okay, your second pose that we're gonna be learning today is called Warrior Two. You might already know this one, but you're oh. gonna bend your knee and extend both arms out. Yeah, and you've got one of your, your feet exactly. You've got it exactly right. You can't see Christian's feet, but his right one is facing forward. That one's facing this way. You're a warrior. That This is what a warrior looks I like. I feel powerful. And that's why this improves kids' self-esteem. Christian's self-esteem is already improved. It's through the roof, it's too high. Well, whoa there. <laughs> Mindfulness is also important. That's true. The next pose is the downward facing dog pose. I know you know this one because even I know this one. Right? Yeah, just except you want to create a little, just, it, um, no, like that's. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, that's that was mostly correct. It's just, just tuck your um, shoulders in a little bit more. Well, no, I guess just the opposite. Yeah, like that, like that, like that. Just accept oh. exactly. Yeah, lean, lean into your, yes, exactly. Oh, this is a Good stretch. Good job, right? Good Let's stretch. In, enhancing children's flexibility. Exactly. <laughs> um, the, our dog is also participating in the downward facing dog. <laughs> she wants to be a part of the yoga experience. Okay, the next pose is called a tabletop. Exactly, it's what you're instinctively doing right now. Right there, exactly. No. That's tabletop pose. <gasps> I know you can't see his arms and legs, but this is the tabletop. The last one, Christian might disappear entirely out of frame because it's child's pose. We're getting real. Exactly, he's gonna, exactly. Good job, Christian. I have taken a yoga class or one in my life. Well, it shows. So uh, thank you for joining us and we hope that you've learned a little bit more about yoga today. Ha, <laughs> <laughs>